Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different than normal. Today I'm going to be doing a kind of like a haul, but not really because this stuff is stuff I've had for a long time. I'm basically just going to be showing you all the amazing finds that I've found at TJ Maxx and Marshalls. Those are literally like my favorite makeup stores. Like I have this like adrenaline rush. I don't know if you just heard my stomach growl. But I have this like adrenaline rush when I walk into one of those stores. And it's so bad I go to TJ Maxx like once a week now. Like... Because you never know what you're going to find, so it was like so exciting. So yeah, I figured today would be a cool video idea if I showed you guys all the stuff that I've found over the past few months at TJ Maxx. Because honestly, if you don't go to either of these, you're missing out because they have some good stuff. I'm going to do different categories, so I'm going to do like lips, face, like eyelashes. And then random. So yeah, if you guys are not subscribed already, then don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to be talking about is this mirror from the brand Impressions, which I believe that's like a popular brand. I'm not really sure. I just feel like I see a lot of people, like beauty influencers, talk about this brand. But um, basically, it's this little rose gold compact mirror and you open it up and it's like magnifying, I think, let me see, look at it. Yeah, on the side it's ma like magnifying double, and then the one in the middle is just normal, and this is what sold me on it. it lights up. I figured that'd be so cool for when I'm like traveling or something. Like I could literally just do my makeup and wait, it gets even better. There is a little stand, so you literally can like set it there while you do your makeup. Like that is literally the coolest thing ever. This was $10.99, which is kind of expensive, but like that's awesome. Like, you can do your makeup so good if you're, like, on the on the go. Like, say you're, like, sitting in, like, an airport or you're in the bathroom. There's, like, I don't know. There's just so much you could do. So I was really excited when I saw this and I knew I had to get it. And even, like, the color, like, rose gold, it's so beautiful. So the next random thing that I'm going to put in this category, because I don't really know what this category is, is I found this adorable little Q-tip holder, and I've never seen one of these, and I thought it was so cool. I just set up my vanity, and, yeah, you just put your Q-tips in there, and then they come out down here. Like, I don't know. I'm easily pleased. I think this was like $3.99. I took off the sticker, but I believe it was like $3.99. Oh, I also quickly wanted to mention that I'm going to be putting the retail price of the items on the screen when I'm editing this, just so you can see how much I saved, because sometimes you find like insane deals. So I'm going to put the original price in the corner, and then you can see when I tell you how much of a difference it was. So the next thing in the random item category is these Neutrogena makeup remover wipes, which these are my favorite makeup wipes and I always buy them at TJ Maxx and I got, like I get so excited. These are $3.99, but literally they're like, I have like a bajillion of them right around me, like they're just my favorite. I always like stock up on them when I find them. So then the next thing in this category is this, which I have had it for a few months and I haven't used it yet, but it's the Saint Tropez Self Tan Express Bronzing Face Sheet Mask, which this is very unique. I've never even heard or seen anything like this, but basically you're just supposed to apply it to your face and leave it on for 5 minutes for light tan, 10 minutes for medium tan, 15 minutes for dark tan. This was $3.99, so yeah, this is pretty cool. And also going along with the tanning theme, I got the Saint Tropez Self Tan Express Bronzing Mousse, which this is a, I was like shocked when I saw this, because this is a good product. Um, but yeah, I just like to apply it with a mitt and apply it to my face. This is pretty much what I use when I self tan myself. But yeah, this stuff is amazing. And then I just have one more tanning item. I got the Saint Tropez Gradual Tan Plus Sculpt and Glow Natural Glow, which I don't really like this one that much. This was th also $3.99, but um, I found this before I found the other one, so that's why I got it, because I was like, yeah, maybe it'll work. But I mean, it gives you like a gradual tan, or it's more like a moisturizer, I feel like. But I don't know. I like the mousse better, but still a pretty good find. Okay, the last thing in the random category is the makeup eraser which I've had this for a few months now too I just haven't opened it because I wanted to film a video like seeing if it actually works but um I googled like so many reviews when I saw this because I I've always wanted one but like I feel like it, it's like too good to be true like there's no way this cloth can actually take off your makeup so um I looked up reviews before I bought it and people said it's like insane good so I went and bought it it was $7.99 which is crazy because I know the original one's like 20 bucks. So let me know if you guys would like to see a review on this and also like a demo. 
Okay, so the next category I'm going to do is lashes. So I found these two lashes. They're by the brand Revive, which I don't think that's anything special. But they're just really nice quality lashes. They come in like this cute little container. It's magnetic, so it opens like nice. They're really dramatic. I haven't used these yet. But these were... I took the price off of them. This, I think they're $2.99 because this one says $2.99. They're like the same brand, so... And then I got this other pair that look like this. They're just really dramatic lashes that I got for like Halloween looks and stuff. So yeah, $2.99, that's a pretty good deal. And then I found these at Marshalls, which Marshalls is like the same thing as TJ Maxx. And I haven't used these yet, but these were when the magnetic lashes were like a big thing. I found the Ardell Demi, yeah, the Ardell Demi Double Up Wispy Magnetic Lashes, which these are so expensive everywhere else, but they were $9.99 at Marshalls. So I was really excited and I haven't even gotten a chance to play with them yet, but I just figured for that price I might as well pick them up and then play with them later. Okay, and then I found literally, I was with my friend Kenzie when we found these. Kenzie, you remember this. We were literally like, no way, no way. We found Lily Lashes. I think they were like $6.99 maybe, I don't remember, I took the tag off them, but... Yeah, literally Lily Lashes in the style Miami. Like, we were dying. We were like, holy crap, like, where's James Charles? We were really excited. Then I found the Double Up Debbie Wispy by Ardell for three bucks. Like, literally, you find the best stuff at TJ Maxx. I literally, this one too, I was like, no way. Like, this is literally not real life. Like, sometimes I find stuff so good that I'm like, where's the camera? Like, who's punking me? Like, so yeah, I found these. Okay, so then this is another one of those, like, insane finds. I literally, like, oh my god. So, like, literally, I'm still in shock that I found this. Okay, so this is the Lily Lashes, and it's by the Sephora, it's the Sephora collection. So it comes with two pairs of Lily Lashes and then the applicator. This was $12.99. This is more of a splurge, but, like, that is still such a good deal. So it comes with the lashes in the style, the lashes in the style Miami, and then a pair of lashes in the style Lux. And this is just the look like up close. So beautiful. So yeah, I was super excited about that. Like literally, how insane. Okay, and then just to end off with the lash theme, I found this cute little lash case, which I'm so bad about like remembering to take my, well, I'm obviously I remember to take them off, but I always forget to put my lashes somewhere. I need to remember where they are because you don't know how many lashes I've lost. Like. I rip them off when I'm drunk and then I lose them and I'm like, okay, there goes that pair of lashes because I, I do that a lot. So I figured if I bought this, that maybe I would remember to pump, like, it's like almost like taking your contacts out. I figured maybe when I'm drunk, I'll remember to take my lashes off and put them in the case. So far, I haven't done it yet, but, you know, it was a nice thought. But I leave this, it comes with like a little bit of glue, you can store your glue in there and then a pair of lashes, but obviously I would put my lashes that I'm wearing in there. I think this was like a dollar's on clearance, but that was a really cute little find. Oh, you little bitch. <sighs> I just spilled the last of my Cody Airspun powder on the floor. It's a sad day. God damn it. Alright, moving on. So, for palettes, I haven't really found that many, but the ones I did find, I was in shock. I found the Anastasia Subculture Palette, which I believe the reason why this was there, because... <sighs> Because is, I think this is the one that everyone was complaining about having a lot of kickback. But I haven't even used it. I've used one shade from it. But it looks like this. And it was $24.99. It's a really nice palette. I just haven't really had the chance to use it. But these are more like fall colors. So maybe I'll need to play with them soon. So yeah, that was $24.99. And then I found the Aurora palette from Anastasia. That's just also a really crazy find. Which I think that the reason why they were there at TG Maxx is because the batch that it did would break easily because all the ones that I've seen at TJ Maxx are all smashed and I literally dropped this from here to the floor which is maybe like I don't know an inch not an inch maybe like a foot and it landed on carpet and this shade broke so I mean probably why I was at TJ Maxx but this was also $24.99 but still I use this every day and I really like it okay and then just sticking with the eyeshadow theme I found literally I just found these like last week. Okay, so I just discovered that Stila has these like liquid lips or liquid eyeshadow sticks that like this. I'm sure you've seen them. They're like extremely pigmented and beautiful. And they're like $24.99, okay? 
so I bought one the other day at the mall and I'm like oh my god this is amazing so I bought another one but I'm like like $25 like that's ridiculous so I was like there's no way like I can't keep buying these so I went to TJ Maxx which this was an unexpected TJ Maxx trip I was like you know what I'm just gonna go out and I'm gonna get dinner and then I was like you know what might as well go to TJ Maxx so I walk in and the first thing I see are these Stila liquid eyeshadows I'm like where's the camera like I know this is I'm on pumped like someone's setting me up like there's no way and that was it I literally found them so I found the shade Bohemian which is this nice rose gold shade and then I found this shade which is called Sea Siren which is this gorgeous like mermaidy like reflex beautiful and then let me just tell a quick story so so then I was looking online at the different shades they had online and I was like oh my god they have a turquoise shade that I really want it's so pretty and when I went to TJ Maxx they only had these two colors so I went back the next day because my sister went I walk in and the first thing I see is this turquoise one that I was literally looking up the night before I was like what is going on why am I so lucky so yeah this is in the shade freedom it's this gorgeous teal color super pretty like yeah and these were $6.99 by the way Regularly like 25 I got them for $6.99. Like, yeah. And then I just got this the other day. This is the Maybelline Color Tattoo Eye Chrome in the shade Khaki Cool. It's just this nice, like, camo color. It's really pretty. I'll swatch it for you. Ooh, let me swatch the, um, the Stila ones for you, too. Okay. So, this is hard to show. On the top is, let me wait from the dry so they stop being so shiny. So the top one is the Maybelline one. This is the shade Freedom, it's the Stila one. This is Sea Siren, and then that is Bohemian. So yeah, they're just these gorgeous colors. It's really hard to show on your arm, but yeah. So last in the eyeshadow category, I just recently got this too. This is the Kat Von D Metal Crush eyeshadow in the shade Iggy. And this is this beautiful, like emerald color let me swatch that for you like look at that that is gorgeous so i was really excited when i found that this is i think 6.99 this is a little bit more expensive for like an eyeshadow but like it was beautiful so i paid for it okay next going in for lipsticks as the category i found this i think there's one two three four. okay there's 30 whoop. There's 36 single little lipsticks in here, and I'm missing one. I don't know where it is. But, um, I think this was, like, $9.99, and, yeah. Like, there's so many different colors in here, so it's really cool. So, yeah. Okay. It's by the brand Measurable Difference. Never heard of it, but the quality is pretty good. And they're all matte, so that's nice. And then, sticking with lipstick, here I have the same lip gloss. This is just the full size, and then this is the mini size. This is the Too Faced Lip Injection, and this is in the shade Milkshake, which is literally the most beautiful color. I love this. I love lip injection um, lipstick because I have no lips. So, yeah, I really like these. I think this the full size was like $4.99. The small size is like $2.99, which is insane. And then I also found the Too Faced... I don't know what it's, what it, exactly it is. Just a Too Faced lipstick in the shade Sure Thing, which is... This is like the type of lip gloss, uh, the type of color I usually go for. Just one that kind of matches your natural color. And there's peaches on it. How cute is that? I didn't even want to use it when I first got it. And it smells like peaches, which I'm pretty sure everything in the peach collection does. But never had anything from there. So this was, I think, $4.99. Now for the next category, I'm going to go in for like moisturizers and primers. So this is another one of those, like, I was like, no, no way. Like, there's no way I'm finding this right now. So I found the um, Smashbox Photo Finish Primer and the Photo Finish Primer Water. It was like a combo that went together. I believe it was like $12.99, which is kind of expensive, but not really for what you're really getting. So yeah, crazy fine. And then another time I just found, again, the single Smashbox Photo fi Primer, which how much primer does a girl need? But I mean, I do makeup for weddings, so I figured this would be nice to have in my collection. And this was, I believe, may leave. I think it was like $7.99 maybe. Okay, going back to eyeshadow, I forgot to mention this. This was, oh my god, one of those, like, there's no way, like, what is happening? This is like a new product. This is the Too Faced Pure Gold um, Pigment. 
This is literally just gold. And I'm pretty sure there's gold in it. Ultra fine face and body glitter infused with real gold. Like what? Like this stuff is gorgeous. I think this is like $5.99 also. Like what? Like do you see that? Gorgeous. And to finish this video off, I'm going to do the foundation found or I'm going to do the foundation. I'm going to do the category foundation. So recently I found the Where's the thing? Becca Aqua Luminous Perfecting Foundation, which this has like one of those like little squeezy tube things. This is a really good. This is this foundation is 10 out of 10. Recommend. It's flawless. This was like 12.99 maybe. <sighs> Then recently I found this is really nothing special, but I mean I'm just gonna include it. This was $3.99. This is the L'Oreal Limus Lumi Cushion. <laughs> Why do I say words so weird on accident? Lumi Cushion Foundation. It just has the little cushion and then it comes with like a little puff. So I thought that was nice for $3.99, might as well. Because like I said, I do makeup, so I need to have a bunch of different foundations. So that is everything that I found at TJ Maxx so far. I hope you guys enjoyed watching what I got and I hope it inspires you to go out and look for your own cool makeup products because honestly it's literally like Christmas. Every time you find like one of those products you're like oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Like at least for me I get like super, super excited. It's like a, an, like a thrill. But um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!